Hello there, this is an introduction to the equilibrium examples uh, involving calculating Kc. So to give you the big picture here, if we're thinking about equilibrium as a whole, there's lots of different directions you could go. You might first of all think of Le Chatelier and temperature pressure concentration. Uh, after that you might be sort of thinking about K and defining K, and we will need to define K, but then there's different types of K. We can have Ka for weak acids, Kp for pressure, and Kc for concentrations, and it's, it's this one here which we'll be looking at, and then we'll be calculating Kc. You can also relate this K through to delta G and uh, energy profile diagrams. So the assumed knowledge here is that you can define Kc. So for example, if we have 2A plus B going to 2C plus D, we'd define Kc as the concentration of the things on the right. So that's uh, C squared multiplied by D and uh, divided by the things on the left, that's A squared divided by B. Uh, I'm also assuming that you can use balance equations to work out amount of uh, product formed in a reaction. Not, not an equilibrium reaction, just a regular reaction. If we've got 2A goes to 2C plus D, then that's a 2 to 2 to 1 ratio. So if we started with 0.3 mole of the A, let's imagine that finally uh, all of that had reacted, so there's none of that left, because that's in a 2 to 2 ratio. We'd say that's the same as 1 to 1, so you'd form the same amount of C as there was A. But because it's 2 to 1 for D, we'd uh, half the amount of D which is formed. Okay, if you understand that, you should be fine with the videos. Uh, I hope you enjoy them.